Checking the cutting system and adjusting as needed are very important for maintaining your mower's cutting performance. You'll need a pair of work gloves and several sheets of printer paper cut into strips. If adjustments are needed, you'll also need 11 and 13 millimeter wrenches. To improve your reach, you may want to use a deep well socket or a regular socket with an extension. The reel spins when the mower moves forward, so be sure to block the wheels before you begin. Then raise your mower to the highest cut height position to improve access. To check the cutting system, spin the reel slowly. If you hear scraping or feel resistance, the cutting reel blades are touching the stationary blade and need to be adjusted. The other cutting system test is to make sure that the reel blades are not too far away from the stationary blade. Perform this test on each side of your mower. Rotate the reel with one hand while sliding a paper strip straight up against the stationary blade, like a blade of grass. Rotate through all five reel blades, moving the paper strip up as it cuts. If the paper does not cut, the stationary blade needs to be adjusted. If the paper cuts cleanly and you do not hear scraping or feel resistance, your mower is ready for cutting. To adjust the blades, use your wrench to loosen the two locking bolts on the side that needs adjusting. If both sides need to be adjusted, work on one side at a time. If the blades are touching, rotate the reel and turn the adjustment dial counterclockwise using the 11 millimeter wrench just until the blades no longer touch. If the blades are too far apart, rotate the reel and turn the adjustment dial clockwise just until the reel makes contact with the stationary blade. Then turn the dial counterclockwise to back off slightly. Check the cutting system again. Listen for contact and check the cut with the paper strips. If there is no contact and the blades cut paper, tighten the locking bolts with the appropriate wrench. Listen for contact and check the cut again. Tightening the locking bolts may change the gap slightly. If the cutting system needs it, repeat the same adjustment steps on the other side. When adjusted properly, your mower is ready to cut.